guys and welcome to my tutorial in which I want to show you how to record your Android device that is running Android Android KitKat so basically what you need to do this is a, a device running Android KitKat and USB cable and the computer so the first thing what you want to do is head over to this website and download Eclipse ADT so after you click this uh, blue button you uh, the download download will start and then after you extracted the files you will this you will have this sort of a uh, um, folder so you want to open it up go to SDK uh, platform tools and as you can see you got a bunch of things over here and the first thing what you want to do is uh, connect to your uh, Android tablet to, to your PC or uh, any device you are using uh, so after you connect it to the uh, to your um, computer you hold shift right click in this folder and then you should have a command open command windows here so you click that and then this little window will should appear so the first thing what you want to put in is ADB devices and they will as you see as you, as you can see the, the number has showed up and it says that device is attached so my tablet is uh, attached to my computer so if I want to record you basically put ADB shell um, screen rec record slash SD card slash the name of the video so I'll just put anything dot mp4 and then when you're ready you just hit enter and now as you can see the recording has started so I will just do some few slides on my tablet and then when you finished you hit control and C and the recording has finished to get your video right now you need to head over to uh, to the uh, SD card on your uh, Android so I will do that right now as you can see the file that I've just recorded is over here so maybe open it up and have a look at it so as you can see the slides I've been doing are fine the video is really smooth so there is no frame drops or anything like this so maybe have a look in what sort of a frame rate this video has been recorded at uh, just wait a sec, just let me copy it over to my hard drive and then we will be able to see what sort of frame rate is recorded at 34 frames per second uh, I know this method can run at 60 FPS if you got more stuff going on so like a FPS game or something so I know we'll, it, this method will keep up with that so if you want to see what sort of a recording quality you can get in the game I will leave a, a link down below in the description to my uh, and, uh, Angry Birds Epic um, gameplay so you can check that out and then this method only records 3 minutes at once so what I came up with is a little uh, comments like this so if you copy this so it's ABD shell screen record and then bitrate so 8 megabytes per second so that's the best pull you can have where you want to save it so SD card and SR3 so that's the name and then what you do is file save as save it whatever you want I'll save it to desktop uh, call it for example start and then save as type all files and then sorry in the file name you put as well dot cmd all files and you save and then after you've done that I've got this little start button so basically when I start it it starts to record uh, my Android tablet and after those three minutes it will start another recording after another three seconds it will start another recording so basically I don't have to worry about if I'm recording the video longer than three minutes that it will just stop and I won't even know this so I hope this tutorial has helped you. Uh, at the end of this video, I will throw in some sort of a gameplay from Angry Birds and maybe some sort of a different video, uh, different game. So I hope you enjoyed. Uh, if you did, smack that like button. 
It was it's always, always appreciated. And if you want to see any of my future videos, uh, click that subscribe button and I will see you later on my future videos. See ya.